It is time for our November Fabulux box. So this one is rose gold. And I have so much fun with the themes, and this theme was really fun, and I can't wait to show you guys. You guys know I'm all about the details, so I had to find the best, um, like, crinkle paper for inside, just to make sure as everything's shipping, it doesn't, you know, like, get moved around, and so I got the cutest rose gold filler, so I always have so much fun, even with just, like, the packing. You're gonna see when you open it is my yay card, and that is where you're gonna have that QR code, and it's going to get you directly to this video. Um, well, it's gonna get you to my website and then you're gonna click on Fabulux Boxes and then you're gonna click on November and then it'll take you to my YouTube video, um, which is this video right here. So let's start digging in. We're gonna do the gifts first and then we're gonna go with the products. So first of all, okay, these are literally my favorite, favorite, favorite hair scrunchies. So these are these like little satin hair scrunchies and I love them because they're not like the super giant ones and they're not the super tiny ones. They are so, so like my favorite favorite ones and so what you guys have a set of six of them and so they're kind of in like that rose goldy like rose gold pinkish theme um so i love these i have to set these for myself um and then we've got this brush so i have the brush here and look how fluffy it is so fluffy and soft and this is going to go with one of the products inside so if you're having some guesses but i have it all packaged up nice for you and then i've got this really pretty adjustable rose gold ring. So when I was in New York, I saw this type of ring everywhere. Um, and so I was like super excited. I was like, oh, that's the one that I got for the boxes. So I love that it's adjustable. So it's just like really pretty and like dainty and will be so pretty for the holidays. Okay, and then at the very bottom, I've got this really gorgeous corduroy makeup bag. And so I love that it's kind of more of like a pouch. So it's like you can fold it up, you can take it with you. It's not super structured and it fits a lot. So I just love this kind of more like, I would call a makeup bag, I call it like a pouch. Um, so if you're traveling for the holidays or if you're even just like in the car for the day, you can just like throw in some hair, makeup, anything that you need for the day and you've got it all right. Okay. So this box is only $75 shipped. Okay. So shipping of this box is like $10. So already shipping you got for free. Tax, did not charge you tax. So $75, the products inside are valued at way over $75. So we've got a powder in the shade of light. So this is going to work for like everybody, okay? So this is gonna be your over your foundation powder that you're going to use and it goes perfectly with our brush. So this powder right here is $55 before tax and shipping. So you're almost already at that $75. Then we've got our, so you can see the like rose gold. So I tried to go with that theme, okay? Our liquid gold is our lip balm. So this is 22. So already we've, we've gone way over the $75. Um, so our liquid gold lip balm, so good. And then, like I said, it's already, it's, it's already $75. Plus, we've got this red, no, it's rich ruby. I was gonna call it red ruby. Red ruby is a lip color. Um, and I was actually just helping a customer find a red ruby, so it's been on my mind. Um, it's a discontinued one. And then this one is rich ruby hydro matte. So this one, what matching my pajamas, is along that theme. Like, I just love that, like, they're all like, so color coordinated, that, like, scrunchie. Um, so this is one that you can use on your lips, on your cheeks, on your eyes. You can do so much with it. And I love it because this color is one that you can wear like in the summer if you want like that like pop of color, but it also has that like just rich like burgundy-ish to it where it can be really pretty for the holidays. And so if you're not like a really red person for the holidays, you might think that this one is just like that perfect, like I said, just kind of like fun berry for the holidays. And I just love that it can be a pop of color in your cheek. So I'm going to show you guys how to use all of these. Obviously the lip balm, I don't have to show you guys. Um, it's, um, it's just a lip balm. I mean, it's more than just a lip balm. It is, like I said, it's literally like liquid gold, but I mean, I'm just saying you use it in the morning, night, during the day. Um, kids, it has no scent. And I just love the packaging that it can be for men, for kids, anybody, grandma, grandpa. Um, this is teachers. Um, I've done this before where I've given it to teachers and said, you're the balm. So if you already have a ton of these lip balms, you're like, oh, I'm gonna use it as a gift for somebody or a stocking stuffer, this would be a great one. So this one, like I said, self-explanatory. I'm gonna show you guys these. Obviously the powder you're just Okay, so fun. let's see how to use some of the products in our Fabulux box. So I have like very, very basic base face on. And that's what I love about this box is that you can put on your regular base face, put on a tiny bit of mascara, a little bit of brows, a base, and then you can do your full face with its hydra mat, and then you can always top it with our like powder. So, um, oops, I held up these two. Those are really good. 
um, these go together. This fluffy brush. Ooh, it's like so dang soft. I think this is my fluffiest brush yet. I'm like always like, can I get a fluffier brush? Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so we've got a rich ruby. So we, I've got my like fall flannel on. Like I said, just kind of like basic and we are gonna like step it up and make it a lot more fun. So you can do this on your eyes, your cheeks, your lips. And so we are going to, I'm gonna teach you guys a little trick. So you can dot it on your cheeks if you want to, um, but because it's not technically a blush, it's gonna dry a little quickly. So I have had a few people say they put it on their, their cheeks and they're like, oh my God, I did not get to, I didn't blend it in fast enough because especially some, um, if your face is more dry, it's gonna suck in the moisture because it's sucking it in because it's moisturizing. I'm just gonna suck it in and it's gonna kind of like leave the dot. So I'm gonna show you guys something like a foolproof way. Um, you're gonna warm it up on your hand right here, okay? So yes, you're gonna have to wash your hands. I always try to avoid that. I try to put things straight on my face, but I'm just teaching you guys a little trick. So your hand, obviously, it's like body temperature, and your your palm of your hand is a little bit of a different skin than your cheek, and so it's not gonna um, suck in as much. You can see it's still wet right there, but it's gonna kind of like warm to your body, and so it's gonna kind of like, I don't wanna say melt, but just kind of like, just like chill out a little bit. So you can use the end of this, and just kind of like dab it around, okay? And you can stick this right on, and then you can go in, and you can blend like this. And then you can just kind of grab. So you can go, you saw that first part was like not as bright, and then I've grabbed more, and I've packed more on. So look at how that just like, wakes up my cheeks and like I said you can go more or less and I love I'll put over the top rosy cheeks are so good and I think I get a little too much so I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that you can see I didn't look at that much so I'm gonna grab my foundation brush and we're gonna kind of go over it So look at how much more awake my face is. It just gives you that little pop of color in your cheeks, okay? Now we're gonna add it to our lips, okay? So this is kind of more of that brighter pink. You can mix it with another Hydromat if you have another Hydromat to lighten it up. But we're going bold. So we just elevated this look from just kind of like, mm, just kind of like, you know, barely there makeup with just this one stick you now have this like really fun look and so this look this could be for a holiday party if you want to add some black eyeliner and you're ready to go you can use this as your eyes as well and you could do eyes lips cheeks you could do just cheeks and eyes you could do just eyes and lips love it um and now we are going to top it off with our powder so the end of every look all you're gonna do is you're gonna open your powder. So I love the design. So you have that little paper you can pull, or the little stick you can pull off, and then take your little brush, and just a little bit comes out so you're not gonna have a powdery mess, and you can just powder, and it's so light. I'm using my T-zone. This brush is so fluffy and so amazing. So this is our look. I love it because you have so many options, and I just feel like it is perfect getting ready for the holidays. If you have a teen or a tween in your house too, these are the best. Addie ha loves blue red. Um, she like looks so good in a red. And I know some people reds just are not their color. And like I tell her, I'm like, I don't know what it is. I'm like, she freaking rocks a red. And she's like, do you have any more bold colors? And it's so funny because I was always like a very like light lip color, like gloss. And I still kind of am. And she is like all for the bold colors and she just wears them so well. She applies them so well and they last all day on her. So I told her that um, she wanted a color like blue red and I was like this one. So this is mine, but I'm setting it over here because it is actually going to Addison because she, and I'll try to borrow it from her too, um, but she's been asking for another like really bold color and I was like, this is the color for her. So if you have a teen or a tween, the Hydra mats are perfect for them. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So. All right. If you guys have any questions about the box, let me know. I love doing these Fabulux boxes. We have one more of this year. And then next year, I am telling you guys here first, we are going to do seasonal boxes. So because I love doing like the gifts, like that's like, like I obviously love the products, but like the gifts that go with it, like 
gives my love language. So I'm gonna do seasonal boxes because I want to do more, I'm gonna do more for each box. Um, and so they will be a little bit of a higher price point, but you're only gonna get them four times a year and they're gonna be packed full. They're gonna be bigger boxes, much more inside of them. Um, and they're gonna be seasonal. So it'll be like a spring box, a summer box, a fall box, and then a winter box. So um, be looking forward to that. But next month is your last month to get the box um, kind of the smaller scale box and then get ready because I will be giving you guys my schedule for um, 2025. I don't even know when the heck 2024 went, but I'm excited because like I said, I will have more time also to kind of gather the gifts because man, by the time I get one box shipped out and I get the tutorial made, I'm buying stuff for the next box and it's so crazy. And so I want to have a little bit more time to shop and make sure that the gifts are perfect. Um, and that way more of you guys can get them too, because I like to, I usually only give you guys like two days to order them. Like this November, they sold out in like an hour. And so I'm going to have a few more. I'm probably going to have maybe like 20, 25 boxes available. Um, we'll just kind of see, um, but be on the lookout because I love doing these and I love doing the gifts and I love finding gifts that like I love and I use that go with the products too. So they're not just like super random things. Um, they're things that, like I said, I use and love like all the things for the boxes. They're all things that I've had or I'm like, I've been eyeing that and I got it for myself. So, all right. Hope you guys love it. I think this will be so perfect for the holidays.